ran uh, disk CNC. Now we'll open the file um, that we want to convert into G code. So file, foam cutter, open top. Then we'll select the file. We put it under C, cut files. And it's something that starts with a P, polyline. OK, open. What we see here is that some of the shape is outside our block. This is our 0, 0 position. But our shape itself is basically at the bottom and on the left side of our foam. And we have to move it. Uh, we can resize this a little bit so it'll be easier to see. Now we'll have to move this entire shape closer to this area. We'll do select, select all, edit DXF, scale, move, rotate, and we'll just click move to origin. Click the cancel button and you see the blue shape is now inside our block. And let's just save it uh, as a new file. We'll call it the C cut files. We'll call it polyline one. And you click on the save button. Now let's load it back again so we have a clear screen. Let's search for polyline one. We'll load this one. And we see it nice and clean. Now we need to set the start and depart. Edit DXF. Change start and depart. We can choose to start from from here. And depart anywhere in the shape. It could be here. It could be here. It could be anywhere we want. And then tool path for axis foam cut. And set this is going to be 30 inch per minute. We can change it to 28 if we want. Hit the create button everything turned into black so it's okay we do see a problem here where the line is going to go through uh, the shape so we're going to fix that we'll just load the shape again where is it polyline and again edit DXF change start and depart we'll start from here and depart here and then what's important to see is that half the shape is green, half blue. That means OK. Um, toolpath, four axis, foam cut, and create. Now we don't have this line anymore. And toolpath, run machine. And we'll save it under polyline 1. And click on the Save button. Uh, right now what we'll see is the shape. And we'll see the G code and you can see it's four axis G code X Y Z and A and this is the feed rate uh, 28 inch per minute that's it now you're ready to load this G code into Mach 3